Hello and welcome to part 5 of Mega Man X2. Welcome. I'm DJing it up. You know what I just realized? I forgot mm -hmm. to see if those last two recordings recorded. You know what? That's okay. <laughs> it doesn't matter, because, like, if it didn't, it's fine. I, I just only talked so much in those ones. For once. I don't know why. I'm Look very those, talkative. Uh... What do we got going on there? Robot chameleons that are killing themselves? I don't know, what's, man. This what's game the thing on never your... surprises me. Uh, the orange thing on my chest, that's an armor chest plate. Oh, um, yeah. by the way, uh... It's like the reverse of the work. armor I was wearing. Like, for your texture pack, it's the reverse of my armor. I thought we left the Minecraft behind in the last... In Zelda no, the, the Minecraft will never be left behind. It will never be Ogre. <laughs> And actually, uh, no, it was nothing like that, Chantel. Well, that's how I pictured it when you described it. You failed again. Maybe I should have edited some of these failures out. Maybe you should have just, you know, all of them out? Well, it can't be a perfect playthrough. Fine. That would look too easy. I have to show off that this part is a bitch and a half to do. Alright. How did you do that? Uh, using a the strike chain to grapple onto the wall. Oh, I nope. see. Oh. <laughs> well, <Wow. laughs> I don't know if that was on purpose or not, but um, That's yeah, that the... was entirely on purpose. That was to reset my live counter. Why would you just do that to begin with? Because I, I wanted the heart. Oh, sorry. That's what I, was yeah, I don't know how Mega Man heart. works. Uh huh. The heart increases your life, Chantal, by the way. Yeah, I, that's kind of how hearts work. It's a heart container. Yeah, yeah, I know that's yeah, how hearts work. They're in uh, Sonic Majora's Mask. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that game. Sonic Majora, best game of 2014. 2052. Yeah. What are you trying to do? I'm trying to get this thing out of there, but I eventually decided to fuck it. There we go. Problem solved. I win. Game over. We can all stop watching. <laughs> Alright, everybody. Thanks for watching Mega Man X2. It's been one hell of a ride. <laughs> and I hope to see you all on our next playthrough. Uh, next up on the list, we have Tic Tac Toe with uh, and myself Minesweeper. and Minesweeper. Uh, next time we have Cameron, special guest commentator, and uh, it's just gonna be him, just alone commentating. Over Tic Tac Toe, Mine Minesweeper. Minesweeper. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, look forward to that. Uh, be sure to subscribe, <laughs> like, and favorite. Uh, plug us on all famous YouTube channels. Just link our channel in there in the comments and say, "Hey, go check these guys out. They're pretty good." I swear it won't murder your computer. No, no, it's fine. And then, um, also check out our TCC Raj channel and go ahead and watch the videos that we haven't commentated yet. And it's then message me on YouTube at Tyrant Four Five One and give me some jokes to tell about the parts that we're gonna watch <laughs> because sometimes I don't have anything and you know, just hit me up. Maybe we'll wow. grab a coffee or something. Alright, I think I'm, I'm done. Lonely. <laughs> it's been a while since I've done that, so there you go. <laughs> yeah, it had been actually. I was wondering when that joke would return. <laughs> well, you know, it's it's gotta happen every once in a while. You gotta go into. How does this platform work? Is there? I'm I'm certain there's a mechanic here. Oh, I see. Every time you jump, it changes the direction. Okay. Um, David, what time are you at? 420, yeah. please. Justin 420 uh, now? Christ, are they, am I bad? Um, what part are you on? Eight. What the <laughs> hell? We're on five! <laughs> David, we're on part five. Uh, excuse me? Part five. <laughs> you said eight. I said, said five. Eight. five. I said five. Oh no, you said we were close to being done. I think there's like eight, and then I just read that, like, okay, what time are you guys at? Uh, part five, 447. 48, 49, 50, 51, 52. Keep going. Keep going. 
55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 5 minutes, 01, 02, 03. Are you almost done, David? 04. Okay, I'm good. Let's let's get back in this now. Okay. Uh, things are looking a little bit different. <laughs> Quite different, as in I have completely different armor. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, spoilers, by the way, in part 8, there's going to be a platform that changes direction when you jump on it. <laughs> that was already in this one, by the way. And there's there's bats and stuff, too. So, so. There was kind of bats in this one, know. too. <laughs> I guess, Maybe I should message myself and tell myself about some good jokes to tell about there. <laughs> Are you fighting a snail now? Is that what's happening? Yep. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Look at that hell. I'm not too surprised, actually. Yeah. Snail of the crystal. I really snail. wish I had seen something like this coming, but... <laughs> By the way, this guy is a pain in the ass to actually Mega Buster. So, please, for the love of God, use his weakness. <laughs> Or you're uh, gonna be here which forever. you're not. I'm not because I wasn't at full health and I don't trust myself enough. Ah. It's a snail, but it freezes you. Crystal snail. Crystal snail. Uh. There's two parts to that name. There's two parts to that adjective animal. Okay. AKA the formula that they always do for the series. Alright. And now I, with oh, his dude, weakness. that looks pimp with that gray and yellow. Gray and yellow, gray and yellow. You're ready to take on the world. Oh, and there's a snail guy again. Yeah. <sighs> snail guy. David doesn't like snail guy. Well, I. Wait, he's got tentacles on his face? Those are antenna. No, 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 I mean on the bottom. On the bottom? On the bottom of his face. Those are antenna. Antenna on the bottom. Yep, you know what? On the you keep missing. Shh. I'm good at this game, I swear. How come you're not using your, your blades? Those are the best at everything. The metal blades? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's in Mega Man 2. <laughs> Steal his shell. Knock his shell off and take it for yourself. There's a way to kick it around, but I forgot how. Steal his power. <laughs> yeah, now I have your power. <laughs> Why does it f like fuzz out like that? Uh, that's him slowing down time. Why does he slow down time? I thought he was just a snail. I don't know why he can. He's supposed to be slower than the world, not faster. <laughs> um, it's a video game. <laughs> Then he should have been Sonic! I'm um, serious! It, it's a video game? <laughs> that is no excuse for the terrible logic. You know, there's a saying, it goes, uh, video game logic, actually, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Wait, how's he messing up your screen? He can't do that's like breaking the fourth wall shit. <laughs> this well, is dumb. This doesn't make any sense at all. He's, he's dead now. This game has better 3D effects than uh, Zelda Majora's Mask. Oh. <laughs> Man, the I background like... is more believable. I like Zelda Majora's Mask, but that force... You got... What are you talking about? That force was a work of art. Oh dear. <laughs> Crystal Hunter. <laughs> I got the ability to splooge. Mm. Congrats, Mega Man. <laughs> Somebody had to make the joke, I guess. <laughs> yeah, it had to be done. Are you uh, gonna finish the next robot boss within this part? Yep. Oh, good for you. And we go from the supposed slowest boss to the fastest overdrive ostrich. But the snail wasn't even slow. He made you slow. Uh huh. I'm biting my tongue to avoid uttering the cursed words. What are the cursed words? Speak them. <laughs> Don't, please. Speak you the have word. no idea what you're unleashing. <laughs> it's not. It's not Satan. So Jacob's you're gotta stay too off. slow. Okay.
Anyways, I don't know why I'm showing this off, but this is, uh, uh if I remember correctly, the uh, secret area where you'd have the extra boss fight if there was a guy here. And actually, yeah, there is. Okay, there was a guy here. Um, we're not fighting him, because I am not going for the good ending. And I also find it's a pain in the ass to go out of the way, and we all also already lost the other guys. So, we're stuck with the bad ending. Actually, I think I... Yeah, no, I don't I don't even kill this guy. Oh, see, this guy's a cool boss. Look at this guy. Damn. Do you know what, do you know what his name is? Uh, no, I, I think I missed it. Agile. Ad, oh, ad, mm. But if he, if he just took uh, okay, never Snail, mind. Okay, snail Dumb's shell, then he'd be, like, perfect. <laughs> he could wear it on his arm. Like, look at that. What a gentleman, too. Anyways, so apparently I guess I went out of my way to kill him. So I got one of Zero's parts, but it's not enough to actually, you know, save Zero, so... Oh, Zero. Whatever. You were like the Sorry, who was Zero uh, again? Zero was The guy like... in the red with the ponytail. The robot. What? With a ponytail? Now you're just confusing me. You'll see him later on when I kick his ass. Or he kicks my ass. A few times. <laughs> What the hell? Why it's with the hair? You you why looked him up? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, um I don't know why, but uh he's a robot. Why does robots hair. have hair? You know what you should have done? Just cut off his hair. Battle ends right there because he's so sad. Well the you thing know how is long that, that would have taken him to He was actually he was actually originally supposed to be the redesign for Mega Man in this game. What? I just realized robots can't grow hair. Never mind. <laughs> well, that design with hair. Oh my god, Zero is a sexy pimp. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Again, wait until you see him. Oh. By the way, I think I was supposed to be. I think I was trying to look for a secret there. I don't know why I died. I'm not even watching the video anymore. <laughs> you just staring at Zero? So who's the other robot in like Mega Man, like actual Mega Man, not Mega Man X? Proto Man. Oh, okay. As in, you know, prototype. Yeah, yeah. As in, it. major spoilers for Mega Man Three. Spoiler alert! Spoiler alert! Alright, I was gonna maybe you know play that. Oh, it's not a big deal. Like it's not like he does much in Mega Man 3. You don't find out much. And, you know, we kind of watched a video that spoiled it already. Shhh. Anyways, uh, this is the... sound like they're screaming in protest. This is the... Uh, I really like this room. It's actually a pretty cool way of transitioning to the boss. Kaboom. Well, we had to stop the missile from hitting, you know, somewhere important. Like, the, um, I don't know. Our base, I assume. Um, Alright, the noise is done. It's over. What do we got going on here? Oh, he's Versus a roadrunner. It's, uh, Duckman. Oh, it's the roadrunner. <laughs> you know, <laughs> beep beep. <laughs> yeah. He also, Sparta kicks you across the room. Yeah. <laughs> he pulls a ray. Oh! Yes! yes. Meet me. <laughs> Someone needs to make that now, please. Someone do an animation of that. <laughs> Boop. Why aren't you using his weakness? Because I was already one point of health off from full health. Oh my god, you know, that's so much. So much difference. Shoot potatoes at him, or lemons, or whatever. Lemon cannon! Still think they're potatoes. Ah! Potatoes makes more sense than lemons. That didn't do anything because he ran off because he ran away. You so know potatoes what? can turn green and eventually a giant blue. My favorite part of the use is watching you fail oh. over oh. and over. There well, you, you go. You would have liked Castlevania part four. Shut up! I had to work! You know, <laughs> With a job that gives me proper hours. That you're too embarrassed to tell to tell people that you work at. Yeah. Do you know how much shit that place gets? <laughs> oh, where do you work, McDonald's? Yeah. Yeah, there you go. 
Yeah. <laughs> That's not a bad job, actually. It's a pretty good starting job. But I think there's too many people that work there. Like, there's too many employees there. It's not a very, like, I, I feel like it's not a very, it's probably a really stressful job to work at. And I think they hire new people way too much, which means they have to fire staff way too much. I don't know, because I've never worked there. I'm just assuming. Sh Sh Chantel? Yeah. The lady with the 15 free coffee tickets. Oh my god, some lady came in with five today. <laughs> five <laughs> Who needs coffee? all that coffee? <laughs> my, my sister just etched in a piece of paper inside voice. I'm apparently talking too loud. Oops. I'm sorry. <laughs> Your sister didn't even talk, she just handed you a piece of paper saying that. <laughs> yeah, it was a huge piece of paper in big writing, and it was just kind of etched in like it would be carved into wood. Like, with a knife. <laughs> At least she's being polite about it. I guess so. <laughs> we did tell uh, her to try and be quiet during this. Mm hmm. <laughs> Great, now we can cut Sonic in half. Yeah! <laughs> Anyways, so this is the cutscene pretty much confirming that we got the bad ending. So... Because uh, the Axe Hunters attacked and took all of the zero parts that we had, because we left some of them alive. So now they're going to rebuild zero, which pretty much means we have to fight them. The good ending is essentially, you rebuild zero, zero comes and saves your ass from fighting a replica version of himself, and then says, I'm too tired to go on, please fight the final boss yourself. Wow, what an ass. Yeah, and then, yeah, that's, that's the only difference, is you get to skip a boss fight. Ah, Anyways. mosquitoes! Ah! Part's over. Ah, there's two of them! Oh, I know, that's a shadow. I'm gonna kill it. <laughs> oh, guys, don't worry, I got it. Oh, my computer! <laughs> I will wait for it to come to me.